Alright everybody, welcome to The Diaries number 4. Uh, real quick, I just want to let y'all know, uh, all of this gameplay is my gameplay. Everything I am talking about is one shot, one take, no editing. Uh, my thumbnails are artificial intelligence, AI through Dolly. So, just so you know, if you haven't known already, I'm using AI for my art. Um, but everything I speak about and all the gameplay is mine. Bang! Perfect. Amazing. Let's go. So, I'm a little bit excited today. I have two mother effing job interviews this Friday. The first one is uh, 8.30 a.m. for about two hours for a paid position of marketing a nonprofit organization. That makes me really excited. The second is around 2.30 p.m. Eastern Time for State Farm. Now, I feel like Pam from The Office, because it's a receptionist gig, but um, I can move up in the company. I've been in finance five and a half years, almost six, so I'm very excited about it. I'm just going to jump into the second topic. I've gotten some advice that the videos are too long, but I make them ten minutes, you know, so when I monetize it, I can get advertisements and mid-rolls. Come on, ladies and gentlemen. Like and subscribe. Either way. Uh, topic number two. It's about the love of my cat, Nora. Um, my cousin, Sam, uh, gave me a cat when I, some really bad times in my life. My grandmother passed away, and I had just, uh, broken up with, uh, the love of my life, Madison, at that time. And I got my little baby girl five weeks old. Ugh, and guess how old she is? Five and a half, five and a half years old, almost six. I love her so much. She's the best. She sleeps with me every night. She hangs out with me and me only. She doesn't like many other people, um, but she loves me. She is, oh my God, she's the best. She really is. Uh, when I leave the house, like a dog, she's waiting by the door. Right? What cat does that? Not many. And that's what's giving me, I think, the most motivation here. I don't want to be fucking homeless. I have a cat. I have a daughter to take care of. And I don't want children. I don't want a human. You know? Uh, I can't do it. Uh, I don't... No. I'm just mad. I can't believe y'all do it. You're crazy. <laughs> what? You motherfuckers are crazy. Excuse my language, but what the... Jesus. You're kidding me? Another human life? Ciao! You motherfuckers. But either way, God bless y'all. That's awesome. I just can't do it. I don't care if I had ten billion dollars or a trillion dollars right now. I just can't do it. Another life? I'm fucked up. I don't want to spread that. Even if I had the most beautiful wife who is amazing and a billion percent better than me. Ugh. I, I, no. It, it's just not gonna happen. Uh. So. Topic number three, my healthy, no, not my healthy, my unhealthy relationship with alcohol. Oh, man. Oof. I don't know. I could drink like six to eight beers a day, ten, more than that. I could, like, I could drink a lot. And it just... I don't know. I don't get sick from it. I'm not drinking liquor, right? So I'm not waking up shaking or throwing up or any of that. But I I need it. it it's weird. I need it to just relax. And I love it. It truly... It, I'm not getting drunk either. I'm just, you know, a beer every hour. Beer every two hours. So it's just keeping, like, the baby as buzz. But I'm just being honest. I don't know. It really helps me. It, I don't know. I want to quit it. Um, I'm about to be 30 years old, right? So my plan is to, you know, quit cigarettes and alcohol by 30. I think I can do the cigarettes. I think the alcohol will be more of an issue. But I'm going to try. Especially for, you know, my family, you know, my mother, my stepfather, you know people who truly love me and have shown support recently, 
I think they want to see me alive. The uh, next topic is, uh, I don't know. It was this weird bodily feeling that I felt like I cried today. But I didn't cry today. I don't know. My eyes felt heavy. My body felt light. And I'll say this again. By the way, ladies and gentlemen, four and a half days off fentanyl. Let's fucking go, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm not going back, baby. We're good. We're getting it. I'm not sick at all. I'm feeling amazing today. Let's fucking go, baby. Woo! Lendy's hype today, motherfucker. Uh, by the way, Lendy, Mac Daddy, Mac Lendy, these are nicknames I've had for over 10 years. Uh, rest in peace, Kenny Graves. Rest in peace, Bobby Weissoffer. I love y'all. And, um, last little topic real quick. I'm gonna make this shorter than 10 minutes today, so just to make it shorter for y'all and get, you know, more of y'all listening. Uh, so, where I'm living at currently, right? My grandpa's not here, nobody's here, the things are all fucked up. Uh, my uncle came back from the UK, but they're working on the bathroom, right? So, haven't showered in three days, almost four, it's terrible, I'm starting to fucking feel terrible. But they're almost done. And the point is, though, um, I haven't had uh, cigarettes recently. I'm trying to save money, and I can't buy a pack. I'll buy like one or two cigarettes a day. You know, that's, th it's uh, $2 for three cigarettes, right, whatever. Um, but the construction work, one of the construction workers here, he helps me out. He'll just, I don't know why, I don't, never said a word. He'll give me a random cigarette. And today, he was like, hey, um, do you know where there's a corner store where I can get a pack of cigarettes? I'm like, yeah, da, 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 right, a block away. And he gave me 20 bucks. I was like, yeah, it's only $12. I, I got a hookup instead of like 15, right? And I go, I get the pack of cigarettes within three minutes, obviously. And he tips me a $5 fucking bill and two cigarettes. What? That's crazy. And I'm still, I think y'all can see the theme here. I'm still trying to figure out why people do such nice things. Or what are they gaining? What are they not gaining? Or are they trying to help me for real? Is there some plan in the back of their head? And I'm starting to realize, no, there isn't. Humans just help each other. And that's what I'm learning. Is that... Sometimes there are just really nice people in this world. And damn, that's something I'm not used to. Thank you for listening to the Diaries number four. And by the way, the gameplay you're seeing is my favorite game ever. Death Stranding. It's all about human connection and love. Thanks for watching, alright? I love you all. I'll see you all tomorrow for the Diaries number 5. Have a good night.